Well, emotions and passions certainly running high here at the state capitol. Those on one side argue parents should absolutely be notified, while those on the other side say doing so could put kids' lives at risk. When you forcibly out a child, it harms them. Parent Christy Hurst making that argument before the Senate Education Committee. She's speaking out against policies requiring teachers and staff to notify parents upon learning their child identifies as transgender or has come out as LGBTQ+. This is harmful. Herself, a mother of three and co-founder of the nonprofit Our Schools USA, Hurst specifically came to the committee to urge members to support AB 1955. Authored by San Diego Assemblymember Chris Ward, the legislation would prohibit school districts from enforcing and implementing LGBTQ plus notification policies and would forbid teachers from outing children to their parents unless the child gives permission. Thus far, eight school districts in California have implemented such policies. It is a safety issue. These policies are harming our students and I know that because they reach out to me and they tell me and they tell me how unsafe they are and in fact it makes all LGBTQIA kids unsafe. To whom and the time and the manner they choose to be able to disclose any part of their identity is theirs to own always. But this group disagrees. Opponents of AB 1955 say school notification policies are necessary to ensure parents are kept in the know about their children. If you triangulate the parents um, from what's happening in the school with the teachers and the school counselors, then how can a parent care for their child? Opponents of such notification policies argue kids could suffer emotionally and consider suicide if parents are unaccepting. But Republicans on the committee believe the opposite is true. If a child is going through that, that parents do need to be notified so that they can be aware if there's anything that could take someone's life. But in the end, that measure now has four votes. The Democratic majority on the committee approved AB 1955, marking what could be the beginning of the end of school notification policies. I am absolutely in support of this bill because of what it means for the child. I will be supporting the bill today, um, and I hope that we will continue uh, sort of working on these conversations to the satisfaction of all parties. And important to note, the bill is nowhere near the end of the legislative process. It next heads to the Senate Health Committee. Reporting at the state capitol, covering local news that matters, Aton Wallace, Fox 40 News.